Happy match day! One of these days I'm going to say happy match day and actually mean it, but today is not that day. Why? Because we have no players. We have no players! Tell me why Gary O'Neill said in his press conference, Juan can only play 45 minutes, Neto, Dawson, Cunha, Semedo all out, Ryan might have to start on the bench. What is going on? We have no no senior players. We're going to have to put... I'm going to have to come on at half time. We're going to get battered. We are going to get battered. But it's fine, because we're all going to be blotto anyway, because it's a 7.30 kickoff on a Saturday. Do I have work tomorrow morning? Yes. Do I care? If you're my manager watching this, yes I do. If you're not my manager, don't. See, normally I'd be feeling quite optimistic, because it is so typical of Wolves to, like, draw to Forest, get beat by Cov, and then go on and beat Arsenal. But given the situation with us having no players, I, I can't see it happening. I just can't see it happening. Anyway, let's get to the pub so we can at least pre-drown our sorrows. Let's go. Today, of all the days, we must pray to the wall shrine that we get something from this game. Miss them. Oh, yeah. Honestly, God, watching when I was abroad on my travels, I don't like my disgrace. Mid region ting out. Stop that right now. Five nil wolves. No, Arsenal. <laughs> That's a pride. I'm not gonna lie. Come on, Shmel. Man! Pass the ball! Oh my god! Why is he rolling on the floor when his team's about to. Oh my god. Wait. Don't concede a goddamn. Whoa! I think either he's offside or there's a handball or a foul or somewhere in there. That's what the Wolves players are complaining about. Maybe it'll be a player or check, but given it's ball, it probably won't go our way anyway. So what's the point? with that as a Wolves fan the boys put in such a good performance given the squad that we had probably deserve to lose did we deserve to lose by two probably not I think one nil would have been a fair result I don't know singing that Mateus Kenya song even though we were one nil down everyone was just positive vibes I mean did it help that it was a 7 30 kickoff and we'd all been drinking since 12 o'clock probably but still the vibes were there <laughs> do you know where the vibes weren't in the Arsenal away end. What was that support? And don't try and say, oh, it's because you're away and shit. No, it's not. We've seen plenty of teams come to the Molyneux and 
have fantastic support. Cov recently were incredible. Leeds are also, you know, always very good. It was it was shocking. <laughs> the support was truly shocking. If we'd had Kenya, Neto, whoever, would it have been a different game? Yes, probably, but that's all speculation. And ultimately, we didn't, and we still put in a decent performance, given the squad that we had. And for me, I can't ask for any more than that. Anyway, I'm going to stop rambling. Um, on to the next one, which is Bournemouth at home on Wednesday. So I'll see you for that. Bye.